So at the Connecticut Joint Replacement Institute, we do approximately 3,500 joint replacements a year. Probably 80 or 85 percent are hip and knee replacement. Although the shoulder replacement business continues to grow. More and more patients are requiring shoulder replacements, and we actually do some ankle replacements as well. So folks ask, what's a typical patient that requires a joint replacement? I used to think I knew that, but it's changed. They're not only senior citizens. Our average age here for a hip replacement is in the late 50s or early 60s. A bit older for knee replacements, but for example, I recently operated on a young woman who was 35 years of age. We've operated on younger folks who were in their, in their 20s. And I did a knee replacement patient that was 91 years of age, vibrant, active, and independent, still drives a Cadillac. So there is no necessarily a typical patient, but these, all the patients have lost their ability to walk. And that's what we're here to fix, is to get their quality of life back, renew their vitality, and restore their, their quality of life.